Play surges forward. Possibility. We are back with another episode of Retro Football. And I say we, Dave is with me. Here we go. FIFA 06, Mike, on the PlayStation 2. Yeah, this is uh, a game I'm not that familiar with. I have to admit, I, you know, I'm like guys with my memory. But anyway, let's have a look at what game modes we've got on this first. We've got manager mode, lounge, tournament mode, create a tournament, practice mode, and online, Dave, on PS2. Yep. Online, that would have been an interesting experience back in the, the the days of PS2 with the network adapter. What is this about retro? So is that going to be FIFA International Soccer? Because one of these allows you to play FIFA International Soccer. EA Sport. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Look at that! Look they call at it that. Fi- they call it FIFA 94 Retro, but that is FIFA International Soccer. Wow. That is so cool. EA were really quirky and and interesting back in those days what happened anyway kick off dave and i are gonna play a match um i've set my team as west brom when we were loading (laughs) in just for lols because i couldn't be bothered to go through everything but we are gonna play as our side and that's my we are indeed so the 2000 oh i i had that shirt my wife bought it for me and my cat shat on it um but we're gonna (laughs) It's a true, it's a true story, guys, and that is why we always used to say Rio, my male cat at the time, because we had a male and a female cat. We used to say he was a Liverpool fan because he shat on my man uh. chair. Right? Okay, so that'll do. Leeds, that's, red against yeah, white. That's fine. Select, Select sides. sides. Yeah. There you hey. go. Come over to my, come over to my side. Advanced again. It's all Let's over go. the place. That that <laughs> that all felt really clunky and convoluted to me. But it is me just being a noob, probably. But yeah, FIFA 06, PS2. The, oh, Old Trafford looks fantastic under the lights. Look at this. It does. We've got some glitching because yeah, <laughs> PCSX2 and all that. Yeah, we do need to have a look at the graphics settings, I think, at some point for PCSX2. We've, we've had that happen in a few games now, but anyway. Um, yeah, I remember this side, actually. Oh, Steve Stone's at Leeds around this time, look. <laughs> Neil Sullivan's in goal for them as well. Right, what cameras do you want? So, I think you can change the height and the zoom. So, telly, and then zoom it all the way out, like we used to do in uh, FIFA... 11, 12, etc. Yeah, that's it. Job done. So. Look at this. This looks game. fantastic. It certainly does. Oh, I've just given the ball away within two seconds. It's all good. <laughs> Change player is the cross button, so in your case, the A button. It is in world class, guys. We did do that before hit and record. We also turned off audio, or not audio, but the soundtrack, because it's licensed. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> you feeling all right, Ronaldo? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see what they all oh, leads just pass it out for throw in. This is Sylvest. Yeah. Mikel Sylvest. So yeah, this FIFA game I remember because of momentum. You'll see next to the score there's some bars. So if we play really well or Leeds play really well, those bars will go up and down, which represents momentum. Oh, that was nice. What yeah. um did you think of this game back in the day? Because I would have been playing pairs six around now. I, would, I thought this game was okay. I still also would have been playing Pez, absolutely. Or well, Pez but 5, this... I was probably playing, actually, even though Pez 6 was out. But yeah, sorry, mate, I cut you yeah. off then. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, Pez 5, I, I would have been playing as well. This this is okay, as you'll see. But it's not as in-depth, in my view, as, as Pez was. It's decent, but not brilliant. i got to say, I like how it feels on the ball. Yeah, it does feel good. It feels responsive, which is one of the things I like about it. Well, Van Nistelrooy. Rude Van Nistelrooy's in here. Van Nistelrooy! Oh, oh, he scores! He's got it! Van Nistelrooy! I one thought, of my favourite strikers of all time. He, he, he is my favourite striker to play for Man United in my lifetime, yeah. for sure. Um, I thought I'd just hit shoot. I don't know, though, Dave. That felt a little bit arcadey feeling to me, the way it flew oh, in. okay. But we'll, we'll give it more of a chance. We'll give it more of yeah. a chance. I'm not sure. I, I'm not feeling as satisfied with that as I, as I thought I would. I was surprised it went in, so that probably should tell you everything. I didn't think it was going to go in, but it did. Weird. Here's Ronaldo, though. Ah, oh, he's tackled me. That's good. It, it's yeah, definitely... You see now... Sorry, go on. 
Next to the one, because we're one nil up, there's now three blocks Ooh. because we've got the momentum. Yeah, because we've just scored. <laughs> the momentum, I love it. <laughs> Commentary's excellent. Visually, it's okay. We've got to put up with the, the glitchy stuff, but it's not the game's fault. Absolutely, um, that's the emulator. And on the ball, this feels decent. It really feels good, guys. I have to say, I'm enjoying it, but... I want to get some more action around the goal mouth in regards to shooting. Because the shooting being simplistic in a football game can break it for me. Yes, it's exactly the same as you've heard us talking previously on Retro Football at some of the uh, the newer PES games. You know, yes. The PS3 PES games. And the shooting always broke those games for me. Yes, for sure. Yeah. Was Van Nistel right? Oh. This reminds me of Champions League. There was a Champions League game on PS2 and Xbox. And basically, this feels identical to that Champions League game. Okay, you're I think in. you covered it, actually, in retro football. Rooney! Oh! Save. Yeah, I, I like this a lot, I have to say. I'm. Um, it's, not, it's not bad. Not bad. But they pass oh. me by me. I, I've talked about this before on retro football. Oh! Some proper glitching going on, guys. I I've had that happen on PS2 games uh, with this emulator before when it goes to cutscenes and close-ups and stuff. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? It's exactly the same as. I've, I've seen that before as well with PCSX2 and FIFA games, oddly enough. But, yeah, I... What was I saying? Yeah, the FIFA games on PS2, after 2003, which I was bought for me one Christmas, I didn't really like it, I didn't enjoy it. I kind of just fell off FIFA. I didn't trust any of the games again, and I just I stayed clear. Yeah, I played these mainly because friends of mine who were still football fans would pick these up anyway just to see what these were like. So, oh, did they? Yeah. Yeah, so that's how I got to play this, and I thought it was okay, but like yourself... Personally, I'd have been playing PES 5 still at this point on PS2. That was a big problem for EA, I guess, was was PES 5. I, I was just... Why would I buy anything else? It was, it was amazing to me. But I guess you have got all the extra stuff, haven't you, in this game? You have, yeah. You've got You're licensed in. content. It's found this, all right. You've got the leagues. You've got the competitions. Crosses it in. Oh. Have a go. Skulls! Hey. Oh, okay. 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 I like how Skulls was off balance there and balloons it over. The, the, there is yeah. something to this game. Maybe Van Nistelrooy, because he is such a world-class finisher, that is just why it flew in and the stats are doing the talking. Quite possibly, yeah. Uh, I can't remember, because it's such a long time ago, the goals that we used to score on this game back in the day when it was a current game. It's a shame. Oh... Oh, good in, cross. Oh, oh, right. What am I doing? He's won the ball. Out. You did well. Skulls. Rooney, when he used to wear number eight. I remember that. Yeah, this would have been his second season at United, I think. Potentially. Oh, what am I doing? Um, Spot on. This was his second. Yeah. I also, going back to the kit, I had this kit too and I liked it. It was a, it was a shirt, yeah. a United shirt I liked. It's You're Rooney. In. You're in. Oh, good save. Oh, I was trying to be unselfish and give my mate a tap in. Van Nistelrooy in the middle there. Yeah, I, I love um, Van Nistelrooy. Yeah, I also own the blue. Was it the third shirt? Uh, yes, for I this season, was. and it had like red on the sleeves. Yeah, I like that as well. It was really, really nice. Oh, Van ah. Sar! It's one one. Ah, oh, sequelizer! It's one one, and it is Blake. Robbie, Robbie Blake. I can't remember mate his first name. Ah, oh, but Van der Sar's got to do better. Yeah, he, he does. He just spills it straight into the path of the lead striker. And again, it's now 1-1. One, one, but I like this game. I really this game, do. This game feels okay. There, there's been subscribers and viewers in the comments on these retro football videos saying, play more FIFA on PS2. It was okay. It was decent. And you're right, guys. There are some good FIFA games on PS2 later FIFA games and I wouldn't yeah. have played these games I would have been a bit ignorant if you like or a little bit Dave's in Dave's in oh what a ball what a ball oh Dave hasn't got now shooting I... boots on yet not that yet that was because of me that was because of me I was aiming down with the analogue stick and it was me that put that wide 
Do you know what I did when I scored my goal? Didn't press anything. I just let go of everything okay. and just shot, and it just went in. And maybe that's why I didn't like how it felt. So for me, it was my instinct kicking in of going across the keeper. And sure. I went across the keeper too much. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Here we go, though. Oh, you're I'm going to be in again. I might be offside, though, just. Yeah, this is okay. I I'm glad we decided to check this one out. And I know a few of the comments have said about the newer FIFAs because they were, they were decent. After FIFA 2004, I would say they got good. It's nice. Oh, oh unlucky. Sylvester. So but best. as good as it is, is it better than PES 5? Would I rather us be sitting here playing PES 5 right now? Yes, I would. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Is this, as, is this as good as PES 6? We should compare it to PES 6 on PS2. I still think PES no. 6 is better. PES 6 is still a better game. PES 6, to me, feels more in-depth. There's more... It's more technical than this. This feels really, really straightforward in my view. Let's quit. Let's quit the game. I want to yeah. see what content we got because uh, that would be the one thing that swayed me and got me to try or got me to p buy this FIFA would be the um, the content, basically, guys. So we've had a look at retro. We know what that is. So we're going to have a look, quick look. We'd have manager mode, wouldn't we? So yes. welcome to manager mode. There you go. 15 season journey etc i'll try and fly you through this bit guys um there's the help desk yes <laughs> create manager but oh there we go <laughs> here are your dudes <laughs> can even have a female manager which is cool yeah oh look at this That's guy good. this guy's awesome looks like the manager of a supermarket i worked for so we'll just do <laughs> that in advance um oh region so We'll try a different country. We'll try yep. that because I'm Seria. boring and I always choose Italy. And we'll choose. We've got job offers here. Okay. So it's limited to the offers you receive. Or can you just choose anyone you want? You can't. Look, oh, I, could, I, I could go to Real Madrid B because I've obviously yep. got to make a name for myself in the managerial uh, okay. circuit. That's I good. I like so you could that. So do I, because all the big names are not there. So let's go Villarreal, because we're going to jump over to Spain instead of Italy. They're a decent club. The board expects top three finish. And then you've got to select your staff. I mean, come on, look how deep this is. Why aren't the football cool. games today, or why haven't they got this depth in the single player? This is a PlayStation 2 game. Yeah, it's, it's from 2005. So here we go. Upgrading your staff as well. Yeah, That's cool. sorry. I just skipped that. We should have had a quick look at that. We've got the... Oh, sponsors. Actual sponsors. Picking sponsors. I remember SoccerGaming.com. Yeah, cool. Look, they're a sponsor was, in this. I was a member of their forums back in 2005. I used to grab option files from this forum. This yeah. is so cool. We're going to go with T-Mobile. Other networks are available. Well, I think T-Mobile <laughs> are defunct now. I think they were bought by someone. Um, yeah. There you go, guys. I'm going to sign. Is there going to be an animation for the sign-in? No. No. <laughs> no, there's not. I used to love that little animation in some of the FIFA games of the pen signing your signature on the contract. But hopefully Dave can play a match here with me. I think you'll be able to. Yes, it should let me select size. Here we go. Next game. Oh, okay. Oh, it's Real Sociedad first. Okay. Yeah, so you can play the game, have a visual sim, a quick sim, change the ticket price to f*** off the fans. You might have to bleep that out. <laughs> this is cool. I mean, football, single-player football gaming then was just... It was a different game, wasn't it? It was, yeah. it was crazy. The depth and attention to detail we had compared to today. What happened? Oh, this stadium is actually in... I think the current day FIFA games. Oh wow, this looks good. But can go. you play though? Yes, go to controls. Oh, okay. Hmm, maybe not then. I thought you could. I thought there'd be a select sides. Yeah, apparently not. Oh, yeah, there's, there's not. There isn't. Wow. That's okay. Stupid. Anyway, just a bit. Here we go though. Oh. Yeah, and, and even if I pause, the same thing happens. So I'm going to just have a show you guys quickly, and then Dave and I will jump into another friendly Sorry. together. But... Yes, oh. That was a good tackle. 
Kovacevic. But did you see any options for difficulty? Because I had set a world class by default, but I didn't see anything then for, for, for setting up the mode. manager mode. Yeah. No, because normally nowadays you do, don't you? you? Get some options for board difficulty and financial do, yeah. sort of difficulty levels. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, anyway, good yeah. save. That, that's manager mode, guys. I would be all over this, and the best thing is the gameplay is actually quite good in this as well. So I'd really enjoy um, playing this back in the day. I have to say, but like I say. Let's get out of here. <laughs> the thing is, Dave, with me, and I was going to say this earlier, is I was uh, a Pez snob. Yeah. Yeah, so was I at this point. Although, as I say, friends of mine did have FIFA games and I play them, obviously, going around their house. But I would always come away thinking, yeah, go back to Pez because Pez just felt so much better to play. Yeah. I, I, I completely yeah. dismissed FIFA. And, and I kind of yeah. regret it now because some of these FIFA games, I know I keep saying it, are decent. Let's go Cameroon, Argentina v Cameroon, just just because select sides. select sides, now we can do that, okay. Yeah. And let's see what happens here, guys. Um, and see if we get a, a, a different stadium, because we've seen two different stadiums so far. We've seen Old Trafford and then one of EA's generic ones. Oh, this looks good. Oh yeah, that does. Modern South American. This stadium is known as. Obviously, it will be one of EA's. But I like how they're catering um, for the audience with their content by giving us all these stadiums and stuff. The glitch, guys, again is is lol. But <laughs> here we go, right? I like this. This looks good graphically. Yeah, it does. It's not bad. Not bad at all. So just here we go. Just got to get some players. Tevez. Tevez! Oh. I like that too, the way the goalkeeper yes. pushed it away from himself and it bounced. Yeah, the animation was really nice. Yeah, this game's good. Maybe we should include this on the Graham Pole for a certain other series that we do in the future. Would that be on the couch by any chance? Yes. It might be on the couch by some chance, yeah. <laughs> I would happily play this. I find so far that world class difficulty, which is the highest in Sorry. this, guys. It's okay. It's a nice balance. It feels decent to play. It's not like super scripted and impossible. So it's an, it's an enjoyable yeah. game. Yeah, I'm I'm in complete agreement. It feels good. What was FIFA? Because you know what my memory is like. I must say that twice on every video we do. But what was it like, mate, on 360 FIFA 06? Was it even FIFA on 06? 360. It was. Yeah, it was the first FIFA actually on oh, 360. FIFA really? 06 yeah, Road yeah. to World Cup. However, it only had international teams, so it was cut down compared to this. And you could only qualify for the World Cup itself. You couldn't actually play in the finals, which was ridiculous. What? Are you serious? Yeah, totally serious. And we will cover it for a future retro football because we have to. Yeah, we'll do it with your setup, I think. We'll, uh, we'll, yeah. we'll, we'll beam over live to Dave's. <laughs> And uh, use the old capture card and uh, your actual 360 console rather than emulation software to do that. Because yep. I need to see that game now. I think it was a launch game on 360, wasn't it? It most certainly was. It was actually the very first Xbox 360 game that I bought when I picked my machine up all those years ago. In fact, wow, 18 years ago, the Xbox 360 wow. came out, 2005. Yeah, this makes a lot of sense because my... Uh, games I played on 360 at launch were Call of Duty 2 yep. and was PGR one of the launch games? PGR 3 most certainly was because yeah. that was the second game that I bought as well as COD 2. Yeah, they were the two games I played and I had the Xbox as well but I had that in a different yeah. room and that was my what I used to call my PES 5 machine. So yeah. I didn't touch football games on 360 until PES 6 and I was very disappointed with that. So, yeah, it'd be interesting to take a look at that FIFA game on 360. Again, we'll use Dave's setup for that. Um, but yep, this has we will. been FIFA 06 on PlayStation 2. Let us know what you think, guys, in the replies. Did you play a lot of this? How do you think it compares to other FIFAs, etc., etc.? And we'll speak to you all very soon.